Well, hey everybody and welcome to today's Grace Life Thursday Update. This coming weekend is Easter weekend and we're super excited about all that God will be doing this weekend as we gather together. On Friday will be our Good Friday service that begins at 6.30. We'll be having a great time of worship and communion together, and I hope you and your family will plan to be here. And then on Easter Sunday, please remember that we won't be having life groups that day, but two worship services, one at 9.30 and the other at 11 o'clock. I'm super excited that our VIP lot is now ready and available for you to park in on Easter Sunday morning. So if you can help us out by being in the VIP lot, that would be wonderful. And we're very thankful God's provided this new parking lot for us. Now we'll soon be finishing up our 21 days of prayer. There are prayer meetings here at the church from 6.30 to 7.30 this evening and Saturday evening. If you can join us, that'd be great. If you can't be here in person, then please be praying with us through the prayer guide as we finish up our 21 days of prayer preparing for Easter Sunday. Now this coming Sunday, we'll be beginning our week of prayer for North American missions. We'll have prayer guides available for you as well as offering envelopes to pick up this Sunday in the Great Room. You may not know, but this mission offering supports some 3,000 missionaries who serve us as Southern Baptists on the continent of North America. There are 280 million people who don't know Jesus in North America and who speak 350 different languages. Each week during the eight days of our week of prayer, we'll be praying for different North American missionaries who serve Southern Baptist and serve us communicating the gospel here in North America. I hope you'll be planning to pray with us and ask God how he would have you participate in this year's Annie Armstrong Easter Offering for North American Missions. Now this Sunday, several of our pastors and I are kicking off a brand new sermon series entitled Vision, See It, Live It. And we'll spend the next few weeks talking about the vision that God has given us for the next 10 years for reaching the New River Valley and beyond with the message of the gospel. It's going to be a great time as we worship together on Easter Sunday, celebrating the resurrection and beginning the new sermon series. I hope you're planning to be here at either 9.30 or 11 o'clock. And as always, if you can't be here in person, we look forward to having you join us online. God bless you, and I'm looking forward to seeing you again this coming Sunday.